the person who invented the test pen is truly a genius. By simply inserting it, you can tell whether there's electricity. But why do you need to touch the metal end of the pen? Wouldn't that cause an electric shock? Let's take a look at the internal structure of the test pen. It mainly consists of a metal tip, a resistor, an indicator light, a spring, a metal end cap, and an insulated casing. When you hold the insulated casing and contact the circuit, the test pen shows no reaction because there is no voltage between the neutral wire and the ground. Therefore, no current flows through the indicator light. However, when you touch the metal end cap, a circuit is formed between the live wire, the test pen, your body, and the ground. At this point, the indicator light in the test pan lights up, indicating the presence of electricity. The reason you don't feel an electric shock is that the test pan contains a resistor of at least 1 mega OHM, which protects the body from electrical harm. In a 220 volt circuit, according to Ohm's law, the current flowing through the body does not exceed 0.22 milliamps. Therefore, you don't feel anything at all.